Hi, this is Dr. Eiko Holman. Today's topic is spirit, soul, and body alignment. Many people are misaligned, and there are a lot of symptoms of misalignment from a vague uh, brain fogginess, tiredness, to some uh, uh, glandular activities going haywire, and uh, all kinds of other more severe symptoms. But if it's misaligned, the, uh, many, many things go wrong, and then quite often the alignment co comes in the spirit and soul, and of course the body, and in four different uh, uh, causes. One is occult involvement, and, uh, and that's obvious because it's abomination to God, and if we uh, have been involved in some uh, occult uh, uh, activities like uh, Dungeons and Dragons and uh, fortune telling, psychic uh, readings, palm readings, astrology, things like that, and that could uh, cause the misalignment. But the main thing I discovered is some people use expressions like, I just can't take it anymore. Uh, it's a form of death wishes. Most people don't think so, but saying I can't take it anymore is a form of death wishes. And so the enemy will use that expression as the legal permission to invade into our lives. And so uh, we, we need to be careful even in jest saying expressions like that. I can't take it anymore, or something similar to that. And uh, so it would be a legal permission for the enemy to invade. And then the another one is the emotional trauma. When somebody, uh, you know, betrayed you or put you down in a severe disappointment or betrayal and so on, and uh, that will cause your soul to be misaligned and uh, out of sync. And uh, the fourth one is physical trauma. It could be a severe accident or major surgery. So if you have gone through a surgery with total body anesthesia, that would be one of the causes. Or if you have accidents where you became severely injured or even uh, knocked out, you know, uh, even semi-unconscious. -un so all these things can cause the misalignment. And so it's important to have the alignment restored for spirit, soul, and body so that you can function the way God designed to function. And I can give you many, many uh, examples of people who were totally misaligned. Now let me give you one severe example. One uh, pastor uh, has gone through, oh, about th three or four surgeries, and uh, as a result, and doctors actually said to his wife, we did everything we knew to do, and there's nothing more we can do, and he's uh, literally on his deathbed. But then uh, uh, my friend uh, knew this couple, the you know, pastor and his wife, and uh, she suggested that I will come to the hospital to minister to him, and I finally agreed, and I was, uh, this was in California, I was living in California at that time, and so I was able to visit him in the hospital, and he was almost in a coma, and uh, he had all kinds of, uh, you know, the record of uh, surgery, and removing certain uh, clogging materials from the carotid arteries and so on. But anyway, uh, you know, doctors did everything they knew to do and nothing more. So when the Lord told me to pull his, uh, hold, hold on to his ankles and pull toward me, and he was lying on the horizontal level and got to his, uh, you know, foot uh, side, and pulled 
his ankles and commanded the inner man to come into his body, I saw a foggy picture of the human body. Uh, I mean, uh, I guess it's a, a spirit part. It was sort of grayish white above the physical body, hovering over, and it started to move, 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 move toward his mouth. And then when it reached his mouth, it went psh, inside the body. And then this man, the pastor, opened his eyes and started to talk to me. And uh, anyway, the Lord directed me to command the, all of the spirit, soul, and body to come into alignment. And then uh, all of the uh, misaligned parts and miss, uh, well, of course, uh, some parts are removed and surgery and so on. And so I asked the Lord to restore and recreate those parts of his body that have been damaged or removed by surgery. And do you know that this was really amazing? Next day, he was ready to go home. But the doctors at the hospital said, no, 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 we have to check uh, everything out. And uh, he was kept three more days. And they uh, uh, checked him out. And everything uh, worked fine. And even the, uh, uh, the plumbing, <laughs> you know, interior pl plumbing in his body worked. And I think it was after three or four days, he was sent home. And then he is preaching even to this, to this day. So what I learned from this is that the Lord told me that even though in his case it was an extreme uh, severe case, but many, many Christians are walking around with partly misaligned, it may not be in a, you know, like a deathbed, but misaligned condition of spirit, soul, and body with mental fogginess and some parts of the, you know, especially the organs and glandular uh, organs are not uh, functioning properly and they can be aligned to function perfectly according to God's design. So this is the uh, <clears throat> uh, CD that is available, and quite often, uh, recreative miracles will happen. I have seen many people with the neck, the discs in, in the neck restored, their shoulders, the cartilage, uh, you, you know, gone, or the hip joint and knee joints, uh, you know, partially, you know, cartilage is partially gone. And after this type of alignment seemed to uh, instigate the alignment of the whole body, including the, you know, every cell, every tissue, every organ, and gland, and so on, and to bring to normalcy that includes recreative miracles. Amen.